Man, it sounds like we got them all around us, doesn't it? Yeah, this area is probably a bit safer on this one. Because there's only one zombie there. Uh, okay, here's 9mm trade. If you need 9mm. Okay, so how, it is the situation. Beyond the big blast doors, there is... Oh, gee, I could buy a camel. Camel? Yep, to ride. Oh, you mean then, uh... That's difficult. Go up and slap him in the face, right? Well, the colour of him, he looks like a freaking elephant. <laughs> it's more... Oh, yeah? Yeah. And he's running. After two shots on the backside. It sounds like he's right in front of me somewhere. Which, uh, even though it's dead, it's uh, acting a bit weird. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Scum. I'm your host, 2005 Guy of Road 2. Okay, so I'm not completely sure what's going to be on today's video. I'm hoping to add a bit with the uh, uh, the, the hullabaloo that we had with the uh, trying to get a plane. Uh, basically somebody was a little bit impatient and um, yeah, we had uh, a little bit of fun. We had some grief. We um, had some accidents, uh, lots of skydiving and uh, various other things, and uh, a couple of splats as well while skydiving as well. Um, but uh, don't want to get uh, too far ahead of, of ourselves just in case it might not be on this video, although I'm trying to add it on there for you guys. Um, for information as to what's in, in, on this video and what time frames and stuff like that, uh, that will all be listed in the description tab. So under the video um, where it's got a brief description of the video, you'll have a little tab that says uh, disc um, descriptions or something there about. Uh, just click that tab and it, for some reason nowadays it's coming up on the right side of the, uh, the screen. Um, there you'll have a whole list of um, time frames along with what's happening on those time frames. Uh, also when it comes to the music, uh, not only will I have it on the, uh, the screen, but I'll also have it listed as to which song is where on the playlist as to uh, when it's going to come up. Um, and then if you guys are interested in uh, that music and you can't find it on that particular um, uh, web website that I listed, there are usually one or two, uh, two, one or two more uh, locations that that uh, person has um, music stored on a different library somewhere else on the web. Um, so that said, um, we first off we're going to start off with a, a time lapse where we're building on the on the runway. Um, this is a little bit hairy. Um, Basically, there's a Mac going backwards and forwards, so we have to be very careful when we're building it. Um, so some of the restrictions that are in-game have uh, been removed so that we can build near and actually on top of um, various um, POIs. So that said, I'm going to leave you guys here with a video. If you want to know what's actually coming up on at what time, just hit the uh, descriptions. Uh, if you guys uh, like the video, please uh, leave a like. Um, if you've got any hints or tips for things that uh, you guys have found out that uh, might work that I have not been able to, able to find yet, uh, or if you've got a faster way of doing things, please, by all means, uh, leave a comment down below. Uh, tips are always welcome. Um, if you didn't like the video, please let me know why in the comments below as to why you didn't like the video. Uh, also, if you're not subscribed already, please hit the subscribe button to help the channel grow. And if you want to get notified when the next video or possible live stream goes up, 
please hit the um, the little bell icon and select all to get notified when the next video or live stream goes up. Thank you all in advance for watching and I hope that you guys enjoy the video and future videos to come. So I'll leave it here and uh, let you guys get on with the actual video itself.
You okay? Yeah, I'm okay. There's another one by the end of that door. Yeah, that goes into one of the big rooms, I think. And it's going to have a bunch of them in there. We need to go down and check out the, the halls down here first. Because there should be another room like that other one we were in down here. Did you open that door up there? No, but I can shoot him through the door. Oh, okay. No, nope, that just goes back out to where we came in from. Okay, are you ready? I've only got one round, though. Ugh. Let's see. Um, I'm trying to check the ammo I have got, because I wonder if I can use the Glock instead. Ammo for this thing. None. What kind of ammo you use? Let's see what I got. Oh, I use this uh, 45 ACP rounds. Do you have anything like that? No. I got 357. And I got 7.62. Yeah. 58. No, I haven't got any of the right ammunition. All I've got is one shell for the shotgun. You wouldn't have any uh, shotgun shells on you, would you? No. Nope. Oh, wait a minute. These 7.62, I should be able to to put in this uh, M16A4. I guess you're going to be the gunner then. Uh, let's yep. see if I got... Yeah, but I can only do it one, one round at a time. Oh, no. Uh... That's the no case. magazine. No, no magazine. Okay, so I'm just going to have to use this first shot and switch to machete then. Maybe one of them will have some rounds on them. Maybe. No, it's the compass. Nine millimeter bullets. Let's see if hopefully we can find some ammo. Ah, oh, binoculars. Nine point nine three. Oh. Tactical gloves. Ah, oh, they. Ooh, what do we got here? Got some gunpowder. That's AKS. Magazine, that won't do me any good. So... Sounds like he's beeping again. Man, it sounds like we got him all around us, doesn't it? 
yeah, this set area is probably a bit safer on this one. Because there's only one zombie there. Uh, okay, here's 9mm trade. If you need 9mm. Okay, so how, it is a situation. Beyond the big blast doors, there is a, an exploded guy and a bunch of zombies. But beyond this door here, there's only one singular zombie. I vote for one singular. Yeah. Alright. Oh, no, it's two. And it looks like the... Well, some more good news. The other one exploded the... Exploded guy. Yep. I was hoping them guys might ask. Well, we got it. We should check them and see if they've got any shotgun shells on them. Cleaning kit. What's that? Hey guys. Cleaning kit. Outstanding. Oh, I'll repair this then. Nice. Got a fully repaired um, shotgun, so now it won't jam anymore. Do you want uh, the rest of the weapon cleaning kit? Uh, I got no place to put it right now. I mean, just to use up on your weapon you've got. Well, no, it's the one I've got is uh, that M16A1. I don't have any rounds for it, though, and it's in good shape. What percentage? 72. But it's a 23 uh, bit left, so... Yeah, let me just save it for that AK then. Because I think I've got uh, some equipment for the AK. Uh, it's only because there's a little bit left and the four miles we just use the rest of it. But uh, if you want to save it to later, then I suppose I'll hang on to it. Well, I guess we can use it on this M16A4. A all right, I'm dropping it then. Okay. So you might as well use the last of it. There it is. Okay, it's at a hundred percent now. Where'd you head off to? Oh, there you are. Next year. Ready? Yep. Yep, this is where we've already been. Well, since I'm fully healed now and the exploded guy's gone, we might be able to take on those uh, guys from the blast door. Yeah, we can. We need to find more rooms like this one here, or like that, or like the one that had all the weapons and stuff in it. Oh, screwdriver, lovely. And a harmonica. Well, are we going back to the blast doors? Give me a sec, I'll try, try sight. Uh, play. Doesn't make any noise. It's not doing anything. That's nope. Not yeah, we haven't cleared everything downstairs yet, have we? Unless, hold on. Uh, actions. No, we haven't. There's another section here we haven't cleared. Hold on. Before you open that, get on the machete out. Yep, let's go.
stop slashing. Okay. Oh, you just slashed me there. It won't do anything to you. Oh, I'm bleeding slightly. It might not do any damage, but if you're doing it with the blade, you do wind up getting um, uh, you, you do wind up getting uh, bleeding if slashed. I'm bleeding a bit. Let's see. There's the eagle red dot. Oh, nice. I'm keeping that. So now there's there's an eagle back at base. Treats. Don't have to repair my arms. Wow. Oh. Oh, Man, this is a tough look. Finally. Oh yes. Ah, oh, you got another AK. I was I was trying to patch up my arms. I didn't pay attention to that. Magazine won't fit in it. This one's at least at sixty percent. Oh yeah, I found my own AK. You did, huh? Yeah. Which kind? The AK-47 in this Greg. Does it have a magazine in it? It shows that they have a magazine, but they... But they don't. <laughs> Flashlight. Don't. What is this? Suppressor for the sniper. Thirty out six ammo.
too bad we can't carry those up in the pickup, right? Yep. Have a nice Oops, uh, Z0. Uh, so we'll do all the way on the other side. <laughs> so he was going to give me over two, slightly over two grand for this. So let's uh, see what the other one would give. Let's just do a compare. Welcome, welcome. Here's what I've got. So two eight seven nine. Two eight seven nine. Make two, sure eight, to stop seven, nine. Either buy or get lost. Oh, yeah, but the vehicle uh, one will definitely give you a lot more for it. Looks like it's an additional maybe ten percent on top. Maybe, maybe a bit more than ten percent. Well, that'd be the best way to go. Maybe thirty percent more than the, the general store. If you want me to buy that, you better give me good price. Prices are not negotiable. Is that interest? Oops. Oh. How much for that? 22. Oof. I wonder, does he finally have that tractor? Oh, he finally has a tractor. So I think uh, what I'll do is I'll trade that uh, quad in for uh, an additional tractor. So I've got additional hauling uh, room. You've already got one tractor, right? Yeah. But if I have more than that, then that means I can uh, take a lot more in one hit. Yeah. Because uh, it can take a heavier workload. Hmm. I think I might do that in a sec. Actually, let's do it now, otherwise it will come up so he doesn't have it again. Nice. It's not like we've got a drone just hanging about. I wonder if that's going to explode again. Oh, but it doesn't have much fuel in it, that's for sure. Really? I would think that they'd give you uh, fuel and every battery would be up, everything would be up. Battery and health is up, but the fuel is terrible. Let's uh, sell that additional balaclava. That means that we now have enough uh, enough room to uh, um, take all of the uh, stuff up. Kidding. Nobody cares. Oops. No. Okay. Hey, safe. Oh well, at least the um, petrol station's not that far away. Yeah. Oh, oh you got a couple of them down there, I think, don't you? Petrol yep. connections. Yep. I have to wonder if somebody blew up a tractor at some point because last time I uh, asked him for a tractor he didn't have any. Huh. 
oh yeah, that bike I left behind, I might as well take that one back and uh, sell that one back in. If it, if it can't even go up that freaking hill, that's yep. an absolutely useless bike. Yep. It's a shame that you can't just uh, walk up with the bike instead of just trying to ride it and then find out you can't get up there. Yep. Funky. Where's it? Have we passed it? I think it was. Yeah, here it is. before we do that though. Let's drop those empty bags off in there so just in case we kill something. Why is it still got a lock on it? Hmm. Seems like the tractor's got a lock on it. Maybe um so that's only I can drive it? Yep, right click on it. And then you can put it to private. Okay. So nobody else can get into it. Or you can take the lock off if you want to also. Uh, like if, okay, you want, yeah. if you want somebody else to uh, ride with you, you'll have to take the lock off. Uh, okay. I've got locks on both my trucks and on my chest. Gives you a little bit of privacy on your stuff. Yeah. Let's take this crummy gold spike back. Can't get up that stupid hill. I just couldn't be asked to do that last time. If you scroll wheel, then you can go faster. Interesting. Okay, so with the bike, if you scroll wheel with it as well, you can actually go that little bit faster. So maybe oh, yeah. he, he might have been able to get up that hill with a running yeah. start. Yeah, but the bike's kind of worthless other than using it to go pick up a, a better vehicle. Yeah. Gee, I could buy a camel. Camel? Yep, to ride. Oh, you mean in the uh, over the schools? Yeah. yeah. Yep. Uh, yeah, I don't think you can get a camel to ride in, in Scone. No. Okay. Oh, yeah, before I forget, let's quickly check the. Uh, um, armory, see if that uh, weapons repair kit has uh, gone down a bit in price. Yeah, yes, hopefully uh, it has. 7.8 was a bit on the high side. If you're trying to yeah, place, it was. I guarantee you, I'm well armed. It's still the same, um, 7.2 mine. So it's Shh. still a bit too high. 
I wish that if you built up rapport with that particular trader that uh, the prices that they sell things for would actually drop. Yeah. Maybe it's something to ask for uh, in the um, um, discussions tab. I doubt they're going to do it, though. Yeah. Ooh. Because people can collect so much stuff that they can sell, you know. That one looks like one of the bullets that I've got downstairs in the uh, living room. One from the helicopters. Uh, the uh, test bullet that could actually go straight through the entire house. Oh. Yeah, we, we've got, um, uh, because my dad used to work at British Sheriff's Base, um, we've got a couple of um, a rounds in the house. Um, one of them was um, a test round for a uh, helicopter. Yeah. And uh, the traders actually got bullets that look almost identical to it. With a huge blue nose on it. He's also got an RPG in the box. I wish we could get those. Yeah. Then the Max definitely wouldn't stand a, t a chance. Okay, time to run back. That's typical. Go up and slap him in the face, right? Well, the color of him, he looks like a freaking elephant. <laughs> it's more. Oh, yeah? Yeah. And he's running. After two shots on the backside. They run a little bit quicker than they used to, don't they? Yep. Actually, can we, uh, do like a hunting thing? That was ducking. Hey, you have to do it. The swarm of there was a way to hunt. It's probably only with a rifle though.
Why is he using so much stamina when he's uh, just crawling? A bit crawling uphill. That's it. Well, I think it's a stone. Yep, I just couldn't make uh, any sense out of it. Okay. Oh, I can't find him. KFI what? The bear I shot. I just saw uh, that there was a hunting mode so that you could trace them. Ooh, hey, here a wolf. Oh, can I see a wolf? The answer is no. What are you hunting with? A 50 caliber pistol. Oh, okay. That should hurt him. Yep. It sounds like he's right in front of me somewhere. Okay, one down. Only thing is, I don't know if there were any more there. A lot of times they're going two at a time. Yeah. I don't see any more. He's a freaking big one. Oh, looks more like a bear. But he sounds like a wolf. Maybe it was the bear in front and the wolf ran away. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's a bit weird. Yep. Also sound like a um, a wolf when it uh, when I killed it. Strange. That's my age, eh? No, that, never done that. Yeah, oh, my newest that. character's horse is way too weak. He's good on speed, but that's about it. Yeah. Never. Well, he's got a little bit more carrying capacity, too, but not that much. I've done nothing this gross before, but. Well, and we'll soon have the feet to trade in. <laughs> Wonder how much that's worth. Who knows? Didn't get a bear head or anything? Yep, I got the head as well. That'd probably be worth more than the feet, won't it? Yep. Of course, I, I have no idea where the tractor is compared to where this um, body is and the, if the body's going to remain while I'm uh, out searching for the tractor.
Okay, I'll have to put those back in there in a sec. Oh, I'll have plenty of meat for her as well. That should help yeah, it's just cooking it is, is messed up. Yeah. Let's see if we can find my tractor. It's on the other side of this. You know, I'll have to put that down as a bug report, the fact that the bear sounded like a freaking wolf. Actually, I could always spread that stuff uh, straight in now. Well, the, uh, it might coffee. have been a wolf in the area too, though. Yeah, could be. We need to get that running uh, in. Running experience. Welcome, welcome. Feel free to browse around. Ninety-seven for the feet. And 97 for the height. Well, that's not bad. How about the head, though? 244. There you go. That's better. I think I want to keep that one. Are you going to keep the head? Yeah. I'll put it on the wall when when I get when I can. Yeah. Here's what I've got. There, my thief is all maxed out on all his horse stuff. Though the meat itself, uh, a whole stack of ten, is worth twenty-four. Oops, not done again. Well, I'd sell that too instead of trying to cook it and have it all Maybe go rotten. Yeah. I have had no luck on cooking things in there. I've had a little bit of luck, but uh, not that much. Where's the house?
Maybe I should have sold some of the meat. Mm, maybe I should have sold some of the meat. Still have two legs worth uh, just uh, sitting here. No mind. Well, if it were me, I'd sell it all. Yeah. Because there's, there's plenty of food in the game. Don't need to be messing with trying to cook that stuff. Yeah, it's kind of nice if you can get it done, but it's messed up the way they got it, so. Yeah.
Definitely a wolf. One. There we go, wolf down. Alright. So where are you close? Yep. Um basically follow that uh, main road uh east a bit and you'll find me on the road. I'll be carving up a wolf. Which uh even though it's dead it's uh acting a bit weird. <laughs>
Please don't destroy the vehicles. Please, please don't destroy the vehicles. Phew. So uh, let's get another section of wall up. Very quiet over there at the moment. Which uh, I mean, don't get me wrong. It's definitely different. But yeah, he is still there. Okay. So at the moment, because we've got wall oh, and that's a very, very flat area there nice area to build on. I wonder if the uh, the gate uh, gate doorway is wide enough for uh, to fit the plane through. So if we do find a plane down there, I wonder if we could actually get through one of those gates. Because then we could have a gate on this, this side over here, bear in mind that there's a mech that goes down there. And then we can try and lift off past that mech and I'll come down and then crash straight into the, <laughs> into the fence, probably. But uh, that's something for later on. So let's uh, add another piece.
systems have been shut down on a digital consistency of programming and also errors and viruses. Systems of diagnostic that can now occur under their way. All systems have been shut down on a digital consistency of programming and also errors and viruses.
closed and electrical circuits are energized. Clear all terminals and retreat to safe zones to prepare for ignition. All systems go. All systems go. Traded everything in. Look at the cash. Wow. <laughs> One, two, three, four, fifty thousand, four thousand, uh, nine hundred and seventy-seven. That's fifty-four thousand one seven seven. Poor we. I still have one short, one crappy short gun to get rid of. Okay. Don't want to sell that, but we do need it where we're going to. Ooh. I've got to get rid of that one. Don't need the flashbangs. Okay. So all these supplies can go into the spy chest. I have to make another chest in a sec. Because our metal one is almost full. It had some guns in it because I needed some some locations to put it in, but once uh, the guns are uh, well. Right, once we've got that one full, then it will be completely full again. So let's put these ones back in here. I'm not sure how much time we've got left before our car blows up, so let's quickly do that. Okay, so I put a flag down, or at least the blueprint of one, so we could see roughly what kind of space we'd be looking at. That's fairly big, actually. 
uh, even though the other side does not look all that great. I wish we could rotate them so that it would go uh, into a certain section, but if we pull it back in any further, I guess we could pull it back a little bit further because we can just put a straight line here now. Just like that little bit over there decay. But the, the plan is initially uh, have an outer wall, have an inner wall, and have a base, and then basically inner and outer wall all the way around it. But we have to start with the outer wall because there are mechs all over the place. <laughs> um, and then we have to see if we can get, uh, if we can find a plane in one of these two uh, hangars, if we can find a plane, can we get it out with, without, it getting be, um, without it getting shot to hell? And can it, uh, can it fit between the double doors? That's another good question. The answer is, I don't think it will fit, but we can try it. Um, the, the other question is, how the hell do we actually get it past the mix? Um, I wonder how much runway actually required for that plane. Because if it doesn't eat too much, then we could probably lift off from it, but we wouldn't be able to um, land it, I don't think. At least not without crashing into something. Uh, at least here, we could maybe use this as a, um, a little safe runaway spot, uh, spot uh, where, how we could uh, get it back uh, on here to take off again without it being shot up by the mechs. We could land next to it, maybe. We'll have to play that by ear, but we still have to find and repair and fuel and everything else the plane without being shot by the mechs. And that's going to be the tricky one. So that said, let's uh, continue our build and uh, see how far we can get. <laughs> 